Hey, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ronnie Saha, your host of the card is of the magician, not just a regular guy who does review videos and sometimes reacts to his own videos and sometimes does podcast series. By the way, I'm really sorry for this amount of delay, but you know after Super October I get really lazy. So I'm really really sorry for that, but yeah, but the consistent flow of videos are again resuming. So stay tuned. For that today i'm back again after a long month i'm back again with another self-working card tutorial i'm sorry to disappoint you guys but yeah new content are coming new contents are coming i am i swear they are coming this is not a fake promise like every time so this trick is basically one of the most easiest trick when you are doing a key card principle this is this this uses the key card principle I doubt that I have probably taught this trick before in this channel but there are many tutorials I just couldn't realize if I have posted this trick or not but yeah if I didn't then this trick is going to be a treat for you guys and if you like this kind of self working card tutorials then there is going to be a great playlist for you in, in my channel there are many great amazing effects which you can do without having to use any type of slate of hands and that's in itself is really amazing and by the way, before going to the tutorial or performance, I just want to say that there is a subscriber and down below. You can do anything you want with it. And also there are a few other links in down below. You can check them out. And also there is going to be a very great video coming soon, which I am really excited about. I'm really having fun while making this video, while talking about this video. And if you guys follow me in Instagram, then you probably know what video I'm talking about. You don't have the total idea because I haven't revealed what exactly I'm making the video about. But yeah, you have some idea that what is going to happen. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, then you don't get this news, this amazing, exciting news. So please, here's the link. You can follow me anytime. This is free. So without talking any further, let's get into the performance. So yep. So first of all, to do any kind of card trick, the first thing that you're going to need is a deck of playing cards. And today we are going to use the Avengers playing cards because why not? So let's deck the cards out of the deck. Okay, so let's give it a few shuffles and show you the deck from top to bottom that they are not set up in any particular order. As you can see, they're not, they're completely mixed up and yep. As you've seen the card, they are totally mixed. Uh, or for your comfort, I can shuffle the deck once again, if you want. You don't really need to do that, but I will do that for you. So, okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to deal down a few cards and you, the spectator, is going to stop me anywhere they want. As you know that I'm all alone in this room and in my life, so I don't have any spectator, so I have to stop by myself. So let's keep uh, dealing the cards and i'm going to just i'm just going to stop in a random place so let's just stop here so now what you're going to do is you are going to look at the top card of the deck so i'm you're going to look at the card and i'm going to see the top of the direction i hope you can see the card and just see the so you've probably seen the card and now what you're going to do is now what I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep this card the deal down cards on top of the cards now the deck now the, now the card is completely mixed the card you saw is completely mixed so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to give another shuffle and now as you know the card is completely mixed now what I'm going to do is how I'm going to find the card is a radiation method the radiation method is that I am going to spread the cards like this yep this is a good spread that's what she said now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hover my finger my pointer finger over the cards like this and you and I'm going to feel you just think of your card and I'm going to feel where your card is because you are going to get nervous when I am hovering over your card. So I'm just going to find, find the card like that. So now just I am going to hover the pointer finger of mine on the faces of the cards. Okay, now there is no friction or any kind of doubt in your mind right here in this whole area you are completely calm and tension tension free my job is to give you tension give you stress your card is nowhere right here from here your card is nowhere in this place so your card is not in this pile 
So we have to choose between in from this pile, this pile. So yeah, you're getting slightly nervous. Yep, you are nervous. Okay, so okay, so you are getting calmer. You are getting calmer from right here. So I'm, I'm going to again separate this pile from the rest of the pile. Okay, so now your car is in this pile. Okay, I ha I think I have found your card. And yep, I know that your card is the eight of spades. Yep, I know I'm right. I know I'm right. You can't cheat me. So, you were totally stressed out when I was hovering my finger over this card. So, yep, this is your card. And I hope you like the trick and you are excited to learn how to do this trick. So without talking much, let's get into the tutorial. Yep, so you are back again for the tutorial and the tutorial is very, very, very easy. All you have to do is learn some false shuffles to make this trick more impressive. So first of all, you can give the deck a actual shuffle, an original cut. You can shuffle the deck however you want. Even you can hand over the deck to the spectator and tell them to shuffle the cards like this. And now the deck is completely mixed up. Now what you're going to do is you're going to tell the spectator to look at the face of the cards to see that the cards are not anyway organized. But in this way, what you are actually doing is you are going you are looking at the top card of the deck, which is this time the Queen of Diamonds. Okay, so you have that card in mind and you are telling, uh, you have to memorize that card and you are telling to the audience that, so the deck is completely mixed up. It is not any particular order. Now what you are going to do to, to make this trick more impressive is given false overhand shuffle. This is not at all necessary. I am just I just do this shuffle to make the simple tricks look more impressive because the routine is very simple. I just exaggerated it. So now what you're going to do is give a false overhand shuffle and in this way you are retaining the top card in its position. The queen of diamonds is still right here. So now the next step is you are going to tell the spectator that you are going to deal down a few cards and they can stop you anywhere they want. So in this process what you are doing is you are going to deal you are dealing down the cards and in this process which was the top card the queen of diamonds is going to the bottom of the pile. So now you are dealing the cards and the spectator suppose let's suppose the spectator tells you to stop right here. Now this pile has the queen of diamonds in its bottom so it's set up now you're going to tell the spectator to look at the card this card which is in this case three of spades now you're telling that the card is in the middle of the deck and you're going to put this pile the mixer pile on top of that card and now you can again give a false shuffle like this or you can give many many sh there are many many false shuffles in the in YouTube you can check them out but now you know where the spectator's chosen card is the spectator's chosen card will be in the right side of the key card the key card in this case was the queen of diamonds so as you see when you are when you are going to spread the cards you're just going to look where the queen of diamonds is when you're hovering the pointer finger this was again an exaggeration of the trick you can just straight away reveal the card but i just exaggerated it by by doing the radiation card trick so now you're going to find the queen of diamonds and as you see the queen of diamonds is right here and as i told the spectator's chosen card is going to be directly at the right side of the card so now straight away when you're the, the first time you're hovering over the cards you look at the card and that is the three of spades now you know where the card is now you can separate this pile by saying that you are not getting uh, stressed out when you when my pointer finger is hovering over here now you again dismantle the whole pa whole deck shortly like this and now after that you, in the final act you can just reveal the card that this was your chosen card so yep yeah, this was the trick guys this as i told you this is a very simple trick uh, based on many false shuffles and 
things like that, exaggeration like that. But this is basically a very simple trick which you can do uh, with anyone you want. And with this trick, we are done. And I hope you liked it. I am very sorry for the delay in the videos, but I swear the videos are going to be regular from now on. Every week, minimum one video is coming. And I'm also planning to be in live sessions. So, get excited. This channel is going to boom. So thanks for watching and there is a subscribe button also down there. You can check that out. And thanks for watching and goodbye. Struggle in this place, been in circles several days, never knowing the right way.